Hi, welcome back for another cleaning video. If you're new here, you might want to stick around and subscribe for cleaning videos like this at least once or twice a week, as well as devotionals and kind of a peek into our homeschool life. This is a Saturday and it was really time to catch up on some household chores. My big kids are usually really helpful with cleaning and uh, doing little tasks in our cleanup routine, but they were out today, so as you will see, I was definitely the one doing the bulk of the work, which yes, it often falls to the mom, but you'll see my younger kids hopping in and doing the things they're capable of. There are several jobs and chores around the house that they know how to do pretty well, and I love to have their help and see them give a good effort. Now here come the cutest dishwashers you've ever seen. These boys are my main dishwasher helpers. And you can see they're still learning, but they're a good team. And when they're willing to put in the effort, it goes by pretty quickly. Wow, this is really speed cleaning. I wish the kitchen really got cleaned this fast. But it is nice to see the transformation from a messy kitchen to a really clean kitchen ready for a new week. Now I'm using my essential oil cleaners and I really like using this cleaner on just about everything. And I have enjoyed seeing how it, my granite countertops hold up to it. What do you use on your stone countertops? I would be interested in hearing about that. If you have a favorite product, go ahead and leave me a note down in the comments. I would love to check out some new products for my granite countertops. Now I finally made it over to my bedroom, which honestly is my favorite room to start in when cleaning the house. I think because you get the biggest change in the shortest amount of effort. But it was a good time to change the bed sheets and it's always nice to be able to get into a fresh bed in the evening. Now this is where you get to see um, different children lending a hand and pitching in. I definitely had a couple helpers who stuck with me the whole time and you can see the other ones kind of found other things to distract themselves with. But it was nice to put the living room back together and have a nice fresh tidy living area to enjoy the weekend with. I really just chalk it up to uh, how many people we have coming through the house and these are high traffic areas but we do a lot of sweeping in our house. We're two weeks into our school year and you can see that the bedroom really went by the wayside. We try to have the kids tidy their bedrooms every single day and we try to be careful about making sure laundry gets put away properly, but you can see both of those had turned into an absolute disaster. I'm going to fold all the kids clothes KonMari style and put their drawers back to order because they had all the children's clothes were mixed into different drawers and nothing was really in the right spots shirts pants PJs it was just all jumbled in there so 
I took a little time and got everybody's things back in order so we could actually find what we needed for the coming week. After seeing just what a mess we had with the clothes, it really got me to thinking about doing a massive clothes declutter. Yep, I really think everyone in our household could benefit from decluttering their wardrobe. Maybe that'll be a good future video. As we were working on the boys' room, a couple of the boys were really asking about if we could take the time to flip a couple of the beds over and rearrange the rooms. You can see we have these IKEA loft beds and they've suited us really well for the boys' room because we have the flexibility to either have them like this one is where the bed is lower, kind of in the normal position or flipped upside down so that there's a play area underneath the bed. At different times it suited us to kind of have different setups and so we flipped over a couple of them today to kind of change things up. Even though we didn't rearrange the placement of the furniture in the room, it did give the room a fresh feel. Thanks for sticking with me through this video. I hope you enjoyed seeing our house go from messy at the end of a busy homeschool week to clean and fresh and so relaxing to enjoy for the weekend and be ready to jump into a new week. Go ahead and like this video if you like this type of content and please subscribe so that you never miss a future video.